my gosh, I, somebody help me. It kind of brought back that feeling of, oh God. Now I have a place to live for your kids. Before I came, um, I was living in a studio apartment, and then I had decided to try to move to Mesa just because I couldn't afford it. I couldn't even afford my studio apartment. And so then when I came back, I still couldn't afford anything. And I was living with my brother in one of his rooms. It, it, it was like, an, like his storage room. So I had to like buy an air mattress, and me and my son were sleeping on an air mattress on the floor in that room for a long time. My mom was um, in an abusive relationship with my father, so we had to live in shelters. So I, it kind of brought back that feeling of, oh God, how am I putting my child through this too after I came out of it? I heard about New Beginnings from a friend who was already in the program. Oh my gosh, it felt like such a relief. I didn't have anything. I had that air mattress again, but just to know that this is my place. It's a two bedroom. My son has his own room. Um, I have a little yard and I am doing it. I'm going to do it by myself. I felt a little nervous at first, but because it was a program that works with, with mothers and because my friend um, had gone pretty much through the same thing, I felt like, okay, I'm, you're, you're, you have the right to be scared, but um, it's going to be okay because there's other moms that are doing the program too. So. When I did become a single mom, I lost most of my friends. And when, when I got into the program, I met single moms, which was awesome to me because I didn't, for some reason, I didn't think they existed. And so that helped me keep those friendships and be able to push each other forward. I gained the confidence in myself. The program really helped me be able to look at myself and see like what I've, what I've been able to do. And a lot of the staff had a lot to do with it too. Like they're just very welcoming and they're always encouraging you. And um, I think, as we grow older, we ourselves don't don't um, look at our accomplishments. We just go with the flow. But the New Beginning staff would really look at that and they'd tell me, you know, you're doing a really good job. You should be proud of yourself. And that really helped me look at myself and think, wow, I'm, I am doing it. I can keep going forward. I love the book club. It's one of the best things ever because um, I made some really good friends. I've made some of my best friends out of the book club. And it just gives us a, a time to, you know, be together and, and share not just the stories that we read, but also about each other. I've really learned how to budget. Um, I've also learned how to save and um, how, to, how to just know when to say no. <laughs> because I think sometimes as a single mom, you forget and you just want to do everything because you have to do everything. But it, it really helped me think of what I should do and what I don't need to do. The way it helped my son was because it gave him a mother that was more relaxed and more willing to spend quality time with him. When I was in the program, because I was able to spend more time on him, I realized he had a speech delay. So um, I was able to put him in a good school. I knew I needed to get a better job because there was things that I wanted. And I wanted to decorate my son's room, so I wanted to, I knew I just needed to get a better job to be able to provide for us. I want to be a therapist, um, so I went back for my master's in counseling. When, when I was in New Beginnings, it really helped me think of wow, this is awesome. There's a lot of single moms out there that are really trying to do it by themselves. And so I decided that I, I wanted to also be a counselor for postpartum depression and, and, and gear more towards single mothers. And um, my goal, my ultimate goal is once I graduate and I, I get certified and, um, and go through all the training um, to run support groups for single mothers, especially um, bilingual support groups. I know I can do it if I if I manage my time and my budget, as well as New Beginnings taught me to. We think is maybe never, never me say nothing in, in the United States, because me not speak English, me, Nobody helped me, no work. Me living with my sister for two months. A lot of stress in the house with my sister. It's too small. Mm -hmm. Me called one day, say, it's okay, you bring your kids. <gasps> me so happy, okay. Say, oh my gosh, I, somebody helped me. <laughs> How does it feel having your own, your own place? 